All right, guys and gals, just received this uh, Predator Tools Piranha shovel in today, and uh, just unpackaged it. A uh, outstanding shovel, if you ask me, man. This thing is really nice. I have the Little Eagle uh, by Predator Tools, but over the years, I've I've just grown to where I needed a taller shovel, uh, and I decided to go with this Piranha. Just wanted to kind of give you guys a more in-depth look at it because before I purchased one, I tried to get on YouTube and look around, and there was a couple of guys with videos on there of it, uh, but they really didn't go in-depth. They just kind of showed it. I want to really show you the concave contours of the blade and uh, kind of go into it in-depth. Let's check that out first. That's what I was really interested in. I've dug for a couple of years with that little eagle. And uh, it has kind of a fairly flat blade to it. And that's really what I was looking for with this shovel. Um, well, Nugget Nagana spoke with him on Facebook and he was telling me that this was a lot uh, flatter shovel than the Raven. Uh, you know, it wasn't as round. So uh, that's what I ended opted out to buy. And I was like, man, thanks for the information, you know. Um, but yeah, this one has the... Uh, foot pad holes, you know, the optional foot pads you can buy. I think they're like $10 maybe. Um, I have a couple here at home, I think, off of one of my older shovels. So, I didn't have to buy any, but, uh, yeah, this thing is really, really good quality built. I mean, just excellent. And, uh, this double serrated edges are probably going to rip through the roots like crazy. Um, I just really like it. I can't wait to go dig some holes with it. Um, Height wise on me, I'm about 5'8", and it comes up to about my waist, so I don't know, I'm kind of, some people call me shorty, some people call me, you know, other things, but <laughs> it works for me, you know, I think it's going to work out a lot better, um, just to look down, but yeah, I really like the way the blade's shaped, it's not, it's not too round, you know, it's not too flat, so it should be pretty perfect. I mean, just perfect. All right. Hopefully, you guys that are ordering one can kind of watch my video and uh, get a better understanding of what it looks like. So, I uh, appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you uh, give them a just give them a give them a shot, man. These these Predator tools, man. I've been really impressed with them. I've had mine for a couple of years, and I've tried to tear them up, and I can't tear them up. I've pried rocks, you know, taken in the water. Uh, I've done just about everything I could try to do to really put it through its paces, and, man, it just shines like no other. So, Predator Tools, man, Mr. George Lesh, thank you for some great tools. All right, Zach's 569 signing out. Keep on digging, guys.